We are back, day two, back at Clawson Oysters, and the tide has all gone out. So there's this boat that's out there, this shipwreck, that yesterday was covered in water mostly, and the tide, since it's so far out, we're gonna try to walk out there. Just run on the shells. Don't roll your ankles. Don't roll your ankles. I got my LeBron's on. Look at this, this is so cool. Just mountains of shells. Look at like that, there's a bird on every one of those. <laughs> like this looks like it. There's a little trail of shells right there. Oh. No, don't do it, don't do it. They're, they wear big rubber boots. <laughs> they asked this guy, his name's Penguin. That's his name. He's been working here the longest. He drives the barge. Legend says they used to bring boats out to these wooden poles that are sticking out of the ground. And then at night they would burn them down to the ground. They're like boats that you just need to get rid of. This one was next up to get burnt down and for some reason it didn't get burnt down. And then they just got lazy and now it sits. Just sits here. Ah! It's heavier than you think. She eats lots of ice cream. Oh boy, this is not gonna end well. Oh, 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 it's so sticky. Are you going full speed? <laughs> Step it up, Brian. I gotta, I gotta make sure I don't. Are you going full speed? <laughs> All right, hold on, hold on. Oh, that's buddy. Oh man, how's it looking there? There's so many nails. Should I, should I go in my nice LeBrons? Yeah. Oh! I'm staying over here. Here, catch the camera. Oh, 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 wait. <laughs> That's probably the front. You can see the gears from where they used to steer it. Isn't that cool? You'd stand yeah. right there and look out those windows, driving the boat. I gotta hold you. Giddy up. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh yeah. man. Nice job, Ryan. That's what uncles are for, right there. Woo! <laughs> What's it doing? It's like hiding from the wind. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, it's too windy, little guy. I will you can't block make the wind. it, Lincoln. It will block the wind. See, oh, see? He oh. felt it, oh, he's out of here. Before we film the main channel video, Brian is gonna be our shell shucking expert. He's gonna learn the basics so that on the main video, he can teach us. I just talked to the, I would call, oyster shucking expert here. He says once he's in a rhythm and he's in the zone, he can shuck an oyster in three seconds. So, I feel like we're gonna give Lincoln and Brian like five oysters that they have to shuck while I build a website. I'm a little nervous, I better be fast. My first shucked oyster? You, your first ever shucked oyster from beginning to finish. You've gotta finish the job and eat it. Yeah, that's tasty. Kept it down. That's good. Is it? Corey's going for it. <laughs> the best part was when I, I finally thought I got it started, and he says, okay, you got it. Now just be careful you don't put the knife through your whole hand. <laughs> Safety is number one priority. Here's the part of the day well, where we just finished our filming. It was super fun. Lincoln was, a, you're gonna have to go watch the video. Lincoln was a pro at shucking oysters. I was impressed. We're gonna go on the barge. See the barge out there? It's windy. It's gonna be uh, white caps out there. The boat's gonna have some black smoke because it's gonna be fighting these waves. But they asked if we wanted to go and see how they actually put the oysters, get the oysters from the mud and all that stuff. And I'm like, uh, why wouldn't we wanna do that? That sounds amazing. So first things first is safety. Safety is number one post. <laughs> that is sketchy. There, if he falls in, I'm totally getting it on camera.
just flew the drone outside. It's super windy and I couldn't land it on the boat. So I flew it all the way over and landed it in the parking lot here. That's a first. That was awesome. <laughs> All right, Lincoln, we're back. Is the drone here? Oh, I see it. It's just sitting there waiting for us. I'm sorry, drone. It's alive. It's alive. Yes. Yay. We don't have to do a drone rescue in the ocean. That's good because the water is very murky and very cold. I don't think this would have been like Ireland. I would not have gone in after it. My health and safety would not have been good. I'm very sorry, but you need to come out for health and safety. I think I found it. Right. I think I found it. I got it! Yes! We made it to a little town called Bandon, and this is the candy factory. And everywhere you look, there's candy, and you can try it for free. Look at this. Do you like pate de fruits? It's lemon. You can this, try it. This kind of lemon. It's a little square. How's pate de fruits? Lemon. We got a lemon meringue pie. Lemon meringue pie. That's really weird. <laughs> it looks really, it's like it's really tasty. I feel like this is Willy Wonka in the chocolate factory here. You just go try stuff. This hot chocolate is not the drink. It is, has poblano pepper. It's chili pepper in the chocolate, so it's actually spicy chocolate. Toxic waste slime liquor? <laughs> what is that? That's weird. I feel like I feel like there's poop on the no poop sign. Oh! Okay, Lincoln, what did we just find? Amazingness. The most beautiful beach you've ever seen. Are you ready? Look. Wood. The sun is gonna be setting. Dried wood everywhere. Rocks over here. A lighthouse, a minivan, waves. Let's go check out the lighthouse. of this pier and these waves are just crashing everywhere. It looks super cool so I'm gonna go out there and find them. Okay there's a whale right there in the water just chilling. Just a giant whale. No big deal. Just keep surfacing and then going back under. That is super cool. Corey's getting the shot right now. He's got his camera right here. Oh, oh, oh. I saw it. There's a seal? Yeah, there's two of them. Cool. We're back to the hotel to wrap up this day. It was pretty amazing. I caught Lincoln peeing on the drone. So I evil. saw I saw him almost got taken away by waves. We took a boat out to the water. Boat to water. We did all kinds of stuff. Oysters. This trip has been amazing and we have to get up. I'm playing Mario Kart. Woo! He said something about Mario Kart. Woo. So we're going to head inside and play Mario Kart for the next hour or so. And then we head home tomorrow. I hope you've enjoyed our trip from Oregon because I've really enjoyed it. It's been fun. Brian, did you have a good time? Oh, outstanding. Corey, favorite best, part? Best date on earth. Best date on earth. Oh, best state. State, state. I'm like, this is not a date. <laughs> <laughs>